Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. I am this is video again. I'm back with my five days of gratitude and we are on day number four. So let's get into it. So for day four of my gratitude list, I am thankful for my support system. And that does not just include my parents or family members, it includes friends because support does not only come in the form of money or anything like that it comes in the form of emotional support as well so you can have emotional support financial support and actually physical support and so all three of those are the characteristics of characteristics of every person in my support system and so, of course, my support system includes my parents, my family, or certain members of my family, my friends, my really, really close friends. And that includes the people that are on this journey, this yoga journey with me and those who may not be because you always need an outside opinion for the things that you do just so that someone who is not biased will be able to tell you the truth about yourself my support system definitely has helped me over the years through school through different job changes and just the amount of positivity that they've poured into me even when I was wrong is what has always blown my mind away so just having people that support you no matter what is a big thing for me and of course your support system may change over the years, mine has. I've gained some people, I've lost some people, that's fine. It's a part of life. Those things happen and it's just a blessing to have people in my corner no matter what. And so your support system should be there for you. They should be able to tell you the truth about what you're doing. They should be able to give an honest opinion. They should be able to cheer you on. That's just, to me, that's like the bottom line. Those are the things that you have to do in order for me to say that you're in, you're in my support system. And those are the things that I do as well to those around me. My friends, my family, like I will be your biggest cheerleader, but I also will tell you what you need to hear, whether you like it or not. And that is just a part of being a good friend, a good supporter, to your friends and family. They have to hear the truth every once in a while. You can't be the cheerleader all the time. Sometimes you have to play the bad guy. But it's all for their good. As long as you have their best interest at heart, I think that they will take it well. So that's what I'm thankful for is my support system. Of course, it's ever changing, ever evolving, but it's there and I am thankful for. I'm thankful for the people that God has placed in my life, the people that God has taken away from my life. It's just a part of changing, a part of growing, and it's going to always help you, even though you may not see why in that moment, but it will always help you, the decisions and the changes that come as you grow and so let me know what you think about this video who's in your support system or what what characteristics do you have to have in a person in order for them to be in your support system and if you don't have a support system I will advise you to think about why you haven't considered anyone to be in your support system and maybe think about who you can try to recruit to be in your support system. Think about the people that you're supporting and then go from there. So just let me know in the comments what you think, how your support system works and how has it changed, if it's changed any. And remember, I'll be back again tomorrow with my last thing on my gratitude list. Day five will be tomorrow. So thanks for watching and I will see you guys in my next video.